Today, we will be replacing the seam tape on the stern of a damaged boat. The first thing you will want to do is apply a thin layer of blue tape surrounding the area you wish to fix. It is important to periodically replace your seam tape. On this boat, the owner did not replace the seam tape early enough, and now it is necessary to fill the gaps in the stern with epoxy before proceeding. Next, heat up the existing seam tape with a heat gun. You can then go ahead and use a knife to scrape away the existing seam tape. Because of the damage done to the stern, we are now using thickened epoxy and fiberglass strands to help improve the structural support. For this repair, 5 grams of resin was used for just the resin and also the resin with hardener. Next, place peel ply over the repair. The peel ply is rough, so you won't need to sand later. It is now necessary to shape the previous repair. Use sandpaper or a sanding block to make sure there are no sharp edges. After you have sanded down all the sharp edges, you can now cut the seam tape to size. Make sure to leave a little extra on each side for room to tape it down. You can then go ahead and mix your epoxy. Next, thoroughly soak the seam tape in epoxy. You can then go ahead and add some thickener to your resin. Next, thoroughly wet the stern with the thickened epoxy. You can then go ahead and carefully wrap the seam tape around the stern. Use your fingers to conform the seam tape to the boat. You can then go ahead and tape down the ends of the seam tape that don't have epoxy on them. Now, just let it dry for a few hours and then take off the tape and you're done.